What's up, babes? Don't mind the background. It's not about the background. It's about what we're about to do today, okay? Besties, 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 besties. I have a challenge for you, okay? A challenge for you today. Today, I am going to Sephora and I'm going to see what I can get there for $50. $50 or less. We can't go 51, 52, or 53. Honestly, even with tax included, I want it to be $50 or less, okay? So, we're going to see what we can find at Sephora for $50 or less. I know that, ironically, the time that I'm trying to do this, they are having a sale each day. So, um, certain brands are going to be 50% off with only select products. So, we're going to see what we can find, you know, for sale. And honestly, this is kind of going to be really hard because even minis, even minis, mini products are, like, kind of expensive. But since we're going to do this little... $50 challenge. We're going to have to stick with the mini, um, the mini products as well as the products that are on sale. We're going to try to look to see if we can find any like gift sets and stuff like that. But we're going to try to see if we can find at least two or more products for $50 or less with tax included. So it has to be within the $50 budget. I am going to try to do this, um, you know, this little challenge with Ulta as well. So we're gonna see, Betsy, we're gonna see. Hopefully we can pass the test, and I know we will, even if we have to just get one product, it's just gonna be $50 or less. So let's go and let's see what we can find at Sephora. See you when we get there. Also, I'm gonna be filming on my iPhone, so if the quality is like a tad bit different, that's why my camera, um, I don't know why I didn't think to charge this before I left, but my battery is dying, so it's not going to last while we are in Sephora, so I'm going to film on my iPhone camera, so I just want to let you guys know that. But yeah, I'll see you at Sephora, Bessie. See you in a little bit. Y'all, why did I actually come here to try to see if I can find this? And this is $34, and there was one left. There was one left. Oh my god, I think I'm going to, I may get this, I may. It's within the it's within the fifty dollars, but we're not gonna just we're not gonna just get the first thing that we see because we want to see if we can get more than one thing. But this I've always wanted to try. Look how messy that is. <laughs> just heard like all good things about Patrick Ta's one size stuff. Their setting spray is amazing, and if you're thinking about the fifty dollar range, the mini is seventeen dollars. It's so worth it. You should definitely get that because the mini is 17 By Mario has lipsticks that are $28. And they all look so good. And even their concealers are $29, which is so within budget. So Milk Hydro Grip, they have the travel size for $20. It is so worth it. Um, hmm, but I'm still going to see if I can find something that's within like the $10 to $15 range. But... This is definitely within budget and it's so, so good. There are great things about Tower 28 and I seriously want to try something from them. I've never tried anything, but I've heard good things, especially these. But it looks like there's really not much in there available. Like there's only one available. Hmm. Let's see, which one is this? Yes, it's like clear, which is this one. Hmm, I really want to try that one, but that one is not in stock. Seems like it's good though. Hmm. Patrick Ta, their blushes are for $36, so that is within the $50 range. But like, look at how beautiful they are. They're all like messed with, but so we have some available. Don't know which one I'm gonna get though, but it is within the $50 budget. I have the mini cleansing wipes for $3 and the regular size for $6. So I think I may get one of these. I think I'm gonna get one of the mini cleansing wipes because they are $3. But which one? The moisturizing, hydrating, soothing, or glowing. Hmm. I don't know. I'm gonna get the hydrating one, but then I do want to get the glowing one because your girl likes to glow. But I think I'm gonna get the hydrating one. I do have the sets for $30, so that could be something. You get three minis for $30, so that is actually worth it. Hmm. So, in beauty is within the range when it comes to 
their lip oils like their lip oils are $18 and honestly I think I may get one of them because they just look so interesting and they have all of them in stock so honestly I may try one of them even they have the lip duo for $25 and they have the champagne bronze for $25 but honestly I think I may get the $18 lip oil so I'm trying to see Ooh, I might get one of these because they look so pretty like this one is the Marlot Ooh, honestly like I want I don't know. I kind of want to try the glaze, the Merlot glaze one. But then the candy apple. Ooh. I don't know which one. I kind of want to do the candy apple. Hold on, let me smell these. It literally smells like a candy apple Jolly Rancher. Like, even Merlot. Hold on, let me see. This just smells really good. Like, I, it brings me back to like a childhood lip gloss that I've tried. I just can't think of the name of it. Mm, so what is that one? Well, let me see about the cookie. But I think I want to do the candy apple. Yes, thank you so much. And the cookie one smells like cookies. There's no fruit punch one right here, but I think I'm gonna get the candy apple. I'm gonna get the candy apple. This one is $18. And then I'm also gonna get the hydrating one. So this will be $21. So we still have some money left. And we're at two products for under $50. So yeah, we're gonna get that budget, okay? We are. So we have $29 that we can spend. So let's see what else we can find that are like minis or really affordable. So we're gonna see, okay? I was gonna get the, yeah, we're just gonna see what we can find, okay? So yeah. <laughs> Great things about these two. So honestly, that's twenty-five dollars. Hmm. I think I see. I think I can find something that's a little bit within ten or fifteen dollars. Let's see. Sephora is so sleep on Their collection is actually really good. Like their palettes are ten dollars. I may end up getting one of their palettes, and even their brow pencils are twelve dollars. So let's see. I may end up getting one of these. Like that's pretty. Oh, that is so pretty. Oh my god, I may end up getting that one. That one is really pretty. That is gorgeous. I think I may end up getting this one because like look at that color it is so unique and it's so pretty yeah I may end up getting this one this is the shades I'm debating so I want to I may I may that's actually pretty eyeliners are also really really good and they have like different shades for $12 which is within budget I have all their eyeliners though, so I don't need any more, but they're so good and affordable. Ever thought about getting any of their falsies? And they are $10. Mm -hmm. That's pretty. This one is really pretty too. Okay. Now that's so pretty. I love the wispiness of it. Hmm. I've never tried any of the Lancome products, but I definitely want to try this one one day. Um, it says matte all over concealer, and I'm an oily girl, so that is my vibe. But, hmm. These don't look too bad. They really don't. So the concealers are $29, which is within budget, but still it's pushing it. So I'm gonna have to pass, but I am gonna try them one day.
I've heard pretty good things about the setting spray and their translucent powder. I may get both of them. Mm. And they're like so affordable. $13 for a setting spray and $15 for a translucent powder. All of these products are so affordable. Even their foundation. Lashes are really pretty. I may get a blush. Like this one is like calling my name. That one is so pretty. I may end up getting one of them. I don't know. Let's we'll see. Callfly, I heard good things about, and they're twenty six dollars. I may end up trying one of their concealers. I have a twenty nine dollar budget left, so I may end up trying one of their concealers. Hmm. We'll see. I've heard great things about am I am I Cole? I've heard great things about them. So, and they're $29. They're very affordable. But I think I'm going to try one of these concealers. Hmm. I just got to figure out my shade. But I think I'm going to try one of their concealers. This is so freaking pretty. It is this one. The Donessa Myricks Color Fix. Like, this is so pretty for $20. Oh my gosh. Like, the color is so pretty. Oh my gosh. I've always wanted to try the drunk elephant stuff, but um, it's not within budget. Not within budget. Minty skin is 100% worth it. It is so good. Like, I absolutely love it so much. It's definitely worth it. It's definitely worth it. Seriously. Amazing things about Glow Recipe. I want to try them. I need to get into skincare products because, well, skincare products at, Ulta, I said Ulta, at Sephora. But, yeah, I want to try them. It's one thing that I can honestly recommend. This cleansing balm right here. That cleansing balm is so good. Like, it literally melts my makeup away. Seriously, get this, because it melts my makeup away. But I should, I need to try, like, the Sephora collection stuff, because they're so affordable. Like, moisturizer, eye cream, all that is so affordable. What, what, um, service canceled? Never mind, it's Minis are always the way to go. I absolutely love the one size setting powder. It's so good. I want to try their setting powder. Mm. Concealer is so good. The minis is good to try out. And the one size setting powder, I mean setting spray is also so, so good. And the Laura Mercier is so good. And they're all within budget. Y'all, hold up, okay? Hold up. We freaking did it, okay? So, like I said, today I went to Sephora when they're having their 50% off deals on select products within certain brands. When I tell you, the best time to really, like, splurge or to just, like, do, like, a little $50 challenge or something like that is especially when they are having deals going on because Sephora does not have deals often, okay? Not like Ulta where they be giving you 15% off or 20 They don't be doing all that. Only certain times, okay? Y'all, stop it. I spent $47. I got change back, okay? I didn't have to, I didn't go over budget. I actually went within my budget. $47. It came to $47.39, okay? Y'all, I'm so proud of myself. What did I end up getting, you ask, okay? This is what I got. I got the Fenty Beauty Match Sticks. They are originally 30 something dollars. Let me see. I don't know the original price of the Fenty Beauty Sticks. Gosh, I don't know the original price of the Fenty Beauty Sticks, but they were 50% off, so $16. So $32. No, hold up. <laughs> 
Hold up. Let me do the math because math is not math. Let me see something real quick. Okay, 16 times 2, $32. I was right. Okay, so they were originally priced at $32, but they were on hat, but they were 50% off. So they were $16 today. So I got one of the matte contour sticks. I've never tried them before, but I really want to see what's to this. Okay, so $16. I got the mini Sephora soothing cleansing wipes. This is definitely going to be something that I use when it comes to taking my makeup off and just wanting that fresh feel. So I'm going to be using this. I actually read the reviews on this before I bought it and they have pretty good reviews. So this was $3. The mini was $3. Okay. So I was like, yeah, I'm going to just get this. And last but not least, I got the Colify Mango Drop Concealer and this right here, I said Mango Drop, I got the Colify Concealer and mine is in the shade Mango Drop. So um, when I was swatching, it was between this one and the shade directly next to it. And to be honest, if there was a middle shade between those, that would have been the perfect match for me for a concealer. But um not perfect match but that would have been the perfect concealer shade for me but the mango drop I love a nice bright under eye so I decided to get the mango drop because I feel like that would just be the perfect brightening for me and I love to do something where it's like when I'm doing my, when I'm putting on my concealer if I need like something more brightening if I don't want to put on like a powder that's a setting powder that's more brightening and I just want to add a little bit more concealer for that like you know what I mean like that like that just Mm, you know that just bright under eye I will use this I'm actually I'm gonna use this in my next upcoming video probably I don't know I'm not gonna say upcoming video but I'm gonna use it for my next video that I do for testing new makeup like I said the Sephora savings event is coming up soon in April and baby when I tell you I'm going to splurge okay I'm splurging so please stay tuned for that because I think I may do a no budget, a no budget splurge, okay? No budget. So we're going to see what we see, what we want, and we're just going to just get it because we're going to treat ourselves because, bestie, we got to treat ourselves sometime, especially when there's a Sephora sale because they don't happen often. I'm hungry, so I need to go and get me some food. It is 2.52 p.m. I'm starving. I have not had lunch yet. I'm going to go to Chick-fil-A because when in doubt, when you don't know what you want to get, get Chick-fil-A because Chick-fil-A never fails you. The customer service is A1 and it's just good. They never mess up on my order. So yeah, it is raining outside. So I'm definitely about to go home and just get my, I'm going to get me some Chick-fil-A then go home. But yeah, $50 at Sephora, it is doable. It can happen, but you really have to look if, especially if it's just like, if it's like one product, you can definitely get something for under $50. But when it comes to two, three products for under $50, you really have to look. A lot of times you got to go for the minis or go for a day like this when it's 50% off on certain brands and certain products. So then you like, you know, you can get something within that. But, um, yeah, it was between the Fenty one. It was between the Fenty contour stick and it was one of the lip oils that I was thinking about getting. But, um yeah i am so excited to test out these two because baby makeup another thing another thing i did not tell y'all okay why did i get another bag i told okay this was within the 50 dollars. this was specifically for the 50 dollars budget so i said hmm they have 50 percent off so i'm going to get something that is 50 percent off Okay, Courtney at the Sephora that I went to, okay, you were freaking amazing. Your vibe, your energy was freaking amazing. The, she was the manager at the Sephora I went to. When I say like her vibe, her aura, everything, and she had the cutest like lip piercing, she was freaking amazing and she helped me the entire time. Like she and I are like, we are like eye to eye, hand in hand when it comes to NARS. NARS products, let me tell you something. If there's one product that I will go to, I will I will ride for, it is NARS. NARS never fails me ever. NARS is my pride and joy, okay? My pride and joy brands. I absolutely love NARS, especially their concealers, their foundations, their, their um, bronzers, all that. I absolutely love it, okay? So, okay, let me tell you something. I just got the NARS 
pot concealer recently i absolutely love it and so this was one of the products that was 50 percent off not all of nars products were 50 percent off only certain um only select products so this was one of the products within nars that was 50 percent off and so i'm like you know what i'm just gonna get another one like a backup just in case because it's like i'm not going to get this sale to happen again i think she said that this happens like once um a year this um sale that goes on with the 50 percent off on select products it only happens like once a year so I just had it I had it I had to get it I had to get it it also this was definitely this was going to be one of the products I was going to get if I did not see something else but this is the once I secure the sweat dry till dawn primer baby when I tell you I have been trying to get this for the longest okay I literally went to Sephora at Kohl's yesterday last night they never had this in stock okay never have this in stock i went to the sephora last time um i went like and did like a little sephora splurge did not i have never found this in stock every single time i went to sephora when i said it was only two, i think it was only two left of this only two I was I was tempted to get the other one but I was like no let me try this out first to see if I like it but um Courtney who helped me out at Sephora she said that this was she said that she heard great reviews like she said that this was something that she heard great reviews about she knows someone personally who used it and said that it was amazing I have oily skin so so this is something that I'm definitely like excited to try out <sighs> Like I said, this was not part of the $50 budget. This was a separate purchase. I said, hold on. I said, please bring these up separately because this was within the budget. This is what I came here for, the $50. This was just unexpected, okay? She literally said, if you get another, when the lady who rang me up, she was also very beautiful. She had beautiful earrings. I was like, oh my gosh, girl, I love your earrings. But she literally said, for Fenty going on right now, they have this um, this sale where it's like if you buy, not really a sale, but they have this deal where if you buy a, because I bought um, the Contour 6. She said, if you buy a skincare product, you will get like a free, it's like this free like goodie bag. And I said, please don't do this to me because I literally didn't expect to get these two. I didn't expect it. Okay. I came here for $50, not more. So I said, thank you but no thank you I will definitely um I don't know if they'll have this um little deal going on but if they do next time I'm going but um okay 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 so it is so it is possible to go to Sephora and spend $50 now I want to see if I can do like a $25 challenge but I think the next challenge that I'm gonna do is at Ulta so I will see if I can find something I know for sure I will find something at Ulta for $50 or less because Ulta is drugstore it has drugstore and high-end and it's way more affordable but I want to keep it fair I don't want to get all drugstore products so I'm gonna see if I can find like luxury products as well at Ulta and Ulta also has deals too so let me tell you I will be using a 15% off or 350 off of 15 I will be doing that if they have like any of those coupons but yes the next um the next challenge i'm gonna do is 50 dollars budget at ulta so if you want to see more challenges like this um i definitely want to do a hundred dollars versus a hundred dollars at sephora versus a hundred dollars at ulta type of video is this focus okay I think it's focused but I definitely want to do a more challenges like this because these are actually really fun okay like they're really fun and it's really interesting to see what you really can get with $25 $50 $100 $200 like I said of course if you go to Ulta and you want to spend $100 you're gonna get a hundred products not literally but you're gonna get a lot more products as opposed to if you go to Sephora and you want to spend a hundred dollars you're gonna get like five products for a hundred dollars or four products for a hundred dollars or even two products for a hundred dollars I see I see things at Sephora where it's literally one product that's seventy dollars but they be worth it though they be worth it so I'm the type where it's like when it comes to makeup I invest okay makeup is an investment makeup is something that's my pride and joy so I will spend the money okay but thank you besties so much for hanging with me today I hope you enjoyed this video like I said if you want to see more videos like this please give this a like thumbs up comment down below subscribe besties you are a part of the fam if you're new here you're 
welcome. You're a part of the fam. <sighs> we did our big one today and I'm so happy. I'm so proud of us. But like I said, new videos will be coming up, um, especially the next one will be at Ulta and I'm hungry so I'm about to go. But bestie, I will call you guys soon. You guys will see another, you will see another FaceTime call soon. So please answer, please pick up, please answer your bestie, please, okay? If you like this video, Give it a like, give it a, give it a like, give it a, give it a like, give it a heart, give it a like. If you stayed all the way to the end of this video, I should have put this in the middle. If you stayed all the way to the end of this video, please get, like, please put, like, a heart or something. Just, just let me know. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I love you guys so, so much. And the family is just growing, and I absolutely love that so much. I love that for us. Like, I just love all the people that join the fam and just subscribe and like the videos and love it. Like, thank you guys so much. You guys are amazing, and I will see you guys in my next video. I will be calling you. Please, please pick up. Please answer, okay? Because we may be going back to Sephora, okay? We may be going back to Sephora, but... Seriously though, the next time we will be going to Ulta and we will be seeing what we can get for $50. But love you guys. See you guys in my next video. Bye.